good day, and I welcome you to the finals of the annual quiz competition for students of secondary schools in Ogun State. This is the senior category, and that the competition is proudly sponsored by SD Odin's Foundation. My name is Doki Rauf. I am your quiz master. This final round for the senior category promises to be tough. And I dare tell you that it is going to be tough. Because to get to this point, we are tough times. And of course, today, as the saying goes, when the going is tough, the tough gets going. And the tough one, six of them, are here to slug it out again at the finals. Starting with Samuel. Samuel. Yes. How are you? I'm fine. Um, the experience of the written examination till this stage was not an easy task. Being the first in the written examination was strenuous. I had to work day and night, try my best to be the first in the written examination. And here am I today, being the first in the quarterfinals. Um, glory be to God. Um, in the quarterfinal, the round one and the round two. The round one was not quite difficult, it was quite easy. And in the round two, it was try. It was quite tricky, but I tried my best to match the first in both rounds. My journey through the semi-final, I'll make sure I'm perfect in both the round one and round two by getting 100 points in the round one and 100 points in the round two, so I can scale through the semi-finals and enter the finals. Welcome. To the semi-final. The experience in the semi-final was a little bit surprising because the squire today was not my expectation. It was not what I expected. I expected to have done better, maybe because of the fear from my other contestants. But in the finals, I hope to perform better than what I did in the semi-finals. Samuel. You have also advanced to the finals. Next, to Samuel on the podium is John. Mr. John, how are you? Good, sir. The competition so far have been have been very have been interesting. A lot of intellectual risk has been taken. So uh, the written stages, um, I didn't score a very high mark, but it was the exam was okay. It was just a test of time. So I qualified for the second round of the competition. And John, total score one hundred and thirty. On the podium, uh, the tension was very, was very high. Uh, meeting with a lot of students, smart students, and competing with them, it wasn't easy. Um, making some error in picking question and working with the time, uh, it was really fun. And I thank God I, I, I'm opportune to be part of those that qualified for the semi-final of the competition. Welcome to the semi-finals, a round of applause. The semi-final, semi-final stage has really been a tough one for me standing with six contestants uh, it was really a, a, a rough stage for me uh, actually after the first round the, the foundation round uh, I scored a, a, 40, a 40 marks but on my on my tab I saw it there that I was the fifth position actually my heart, my heart sank that I have uh, missed out of the next stage 
but it was a tie between other contestants. So I moved to the to the next stage of the competition. Uh, by the grace of God, I made it. Uh, I made it to the semi to the finals. It was really a tough one. I just give all the glory to God for making it up to this stage. John, you have advanced to the finals. And the next person is Precious. Precious, yes, you're welcome. Yes, sir. A round of applause for, for Precious. I'm actually here in the quarterfinals and I've qualified for the semifinals. Though it, it hasn't been easy. From the written exam, I was, I was just told a few days to the time that I'm to, I'm to participate in the competition. And I, and I saw the, I saw, I saw how, juicy, how juicy the competition is. So I, I decided to put, to, put, to put in an effort. Though in the written exam, I was, I qualified with 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 two of an inch. I, I I was like the third yet, but I came I came here for the quarterfinals and and I saw how it and I saw how it is. I thank God that I qualified to the semifinals with the two of an inch. The total score for Precious one twenty. I I will do what, what I will always, what I've always been doing and I will even intensify my efforts so as to make sure that I will scale through because I know that as as we go higher the. The, the, comp the competition gets tougher, so I have to intensify my effort and I, and I have to pray to God to give me the grace then, then, to, then to crown my effort with success. Welcome to the semi-finals. When I entered the hall for the semi-final, I was actually in test as first because I, I knew that the best of the best were with me. But I thank God that I, I was able to intensify my effort formally. So during the first round, when I saw what others scored and when I saw the type of question they were giving them, and I was not a further math student, I was I was kind of I was quite tensed. But I thank God when it got to my section, God made me skill true. And precious, you have also advanced to the finals. <laughs> and the first girl. Sylvia. Sylvia. Welcome to the competition. When I heard about the competition, that all the students around Ogun State, the schools around Ogun State to be competing, writing the exam. I was quite tensed because the chances of me winning were very slim. I had only 42 students from the whole Ogun State were going to qualify. So I didn't want to write the exam, but I thought my I said I must write the exam. And to the glory of God, I wrote the exam and I qualified for the quarterfinals. Sylvia scored a total of 130. I was quite happy and surprised that I qualified for the quarterfinals. I didn't expect it. And I was also tensed and afraid because I heard it was going to be in front of the crowd and I have stayed fright. But I thank God. I've, the competition was quite tough. Though I came third, but my score was very high. And I hope to be chosen for the semi finals. Welcome to the semi-final, Sylvia. I was surprised when I was chosen among the best losers. So coming here, I wanted to do my best. After the first session, I was quite tensed because I saw the questions. Everybody, I was so tensed. I saw the questions, they were, they were difficult and it was further mathematics. So, and I'm not so good in that area. But I thank God when it came to my turn, uh, during the first round, I was tensed, but after hearing my score, I did great. I, for the second round, I was relaxed. I knew everything was in control, and I thank God that I qualified for the finals. Sylvia, you have advanced to the finals. And now, Henry.
Henry. Henry. How are you? You're very fine. I can see. You're welcome. Um, when I eventually made it to the CBT stage, the quarterfinals, getting onto the podium had um, quite a load of weight on me because there was tension everywhere. So I just had to pray and I was begging God to just give me the grace to go through smoothly without feeling any tension. And when the questions actually started, I was actually feeling peaceful more now because God has actually helped me to calm my tension and I was really happy to get the perfect score in the mass. And Henry scored 108. When we got to the science, I think I missed a question in the first half and it almost brought me down, but I just kept going and I prayed to God that it should help me to qualify to the semi-finals and I qualified and I hope that it helped me through the rest of the competition. To make sure I try my best to win this, I'm just going to make sure I study and I'm going to pray because I, can't, I, I don't believe I can do anything without God. I'm going to pray more. I'm going to cover more ground and do more practice, power with more people and hope and pray that the best comes out of it. Henry, congratulations. You have advanced to the semi-finals. The semi-final experience was tough, was daring, was challenging, but I was grateful and happy to, made, to have made it to the semi-final. Welcome to the semi -final. Thankfully, I was able to scale through both sections I get in an 80 in my math and then also 80 in the science section, making it a total of 160, time with the top in my group and eventually making it to the final. Henry, you have advanced to the final. Now, the last but not the least, wisdom. Wisdom. How are you? Welcome. So the waiting stage for me was a bit dicey because I was I um, mean formed in Palm 2. So I saw the result and I happened to qualify. I was very happy with my result. Wisdom, your total score is 130. And for this quarter finals, I was under a lot of tension. Because, I don't know, maybe I was not really used to that style of exam. I've not done a lot of practice on that. So I feel for the next um, round, I would work on my weaknesses, um, my speed. I will make sure that um, I'm in line with the time limit. So that's what I hope to do in my next round. Welcome to the semi-final. The semi-finals, as I expected, was a tug of war. Um, it was really intense, considering I had to face um, opponents I don't know, because the, the, the list was not released until when we got to the uh, competition stage. So I was really scared of what I was going to face, because I knew we had tough opponents. But I was really happy that I could scale two in the first round. I was first, and I want to also thank God secondly because he helped me scale two in the second round of the SG Williams competition. I was joined first with someone so it shows how tough the competition was. Well I'm quite delighted but I know it's a call for higher work. I need to put in more effort, more you know, more everything because it's going to be really intense considering I have opponents that are not uh, Miguel so we need to really put in our best. So I'll try to put in my best and see what comes out of it. Wisdom, you have advanced to the final. Yes, 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 yes. For the of Agua, the top one, the seven. But for SD Holdings Foundation, the annual quiz competition for students of secondary schools in Ogun State, 2020, the tough ones are six. Welcome them. And of course, let's talk to the six of them, starting from Sam. Mr. Sam. Good evening. 
Welcome to the finals. Oh, I can see you have changed your outfit. You are always on shirt. Today you are on jacket. Any reason? Because I'm here to Because you are here to win. A round of applause for Samuel. <laughs> Yeah, thank you very much for coming to the finals. Yeah. What is the name of your school? Harp Scholars University. Harp Scholars University. Where is it located? Otter. Otter in Ogo State. Welcome to the finals. Yes, sir. Thank you. The money that is at stake for first position is one. Ever seen something like that? Yes, sir. You have seen things like that? Tell me where. Yeah, I've won some other competitions. You've won some other competitions? Yes. Okay. So? Yes, uh, Mita Swiss Park. Okay. Uh, so you, ha you, you, you plan to make this one of the cup questions that they've won? Let's see how it goes. Samuel, yes. welcome to the finals. John, what is the name of your school? I do come to college. Ideal Comprehensive College. Yes, sir. Not Baptist. I was going to think maybe you are John from Baptist School. I would have called you John the Baptist. Welcome to this finals. Thank you, sir. How are you today? I'm doing good, sir. Very good. Yes, sir. Now, in the event that you win the one million, what do you plan to do? Um, I'll give my tights. I'll give my tights. You'll give your tights? Then? Uh, I'll spend the other hours with my family. On your family? Yeah. Oh, that's so thoughtful of you. So thoughtful of you. Congratulations for thinking so deeply about your family. Welcome yes, to the finals. Thank you, sir. And um, precious. You are not a stone. You are a human being. You must have been very precious to your parents for them to have actually named you precious. Am I right? Good. Welcome, Mr. Yes, precious, sir. to this final. Thank you, sir. Yes. What's the name of your school? Excellent Achievers College. Excellent Achievers College. Where is your school located? Ijebu. Ijebu. You came all the way from Ijebu today. Yes, sir. Oh, and how was the journey? Great, sir. Great. Thank you very much for making it. Yeah. So if you win the one million naira, what do you plan to do? Support Kingdom Projects. So what? Support Kingdom Projects. Support Kingdom Projects. Meaning? Use it for God's work. Use it for God's work. Everything. No. No. What percentage? <laughs> Greater percentage, sir. Greater percentage? Yes, sir. For God? Yes, sir. Okay? It's good because if I ask you, you will tell me it's God that got you to this point. Yes, sir. All right. Plus what? Hard work. Hard work, sir. Welcome to the finance, Precious. Thank you, sir. Sylvia. Sir. The only woman. That is tough. Because I remember that it was very tough. Very, very tough. How many ties did you run? Two ties. You didn't do a tie. Okay. Now, what is the name of your school? Sacred Catholic College of Belkuta. Ah, Belkuta. Okay. Welcome to the finals. And in the event that you win this competition, what will you do with it? I'll pay my tithes to God. Everybody wants to pay tithes here today. <laughs> That's right. It's a good one. It's good to actually be godly. And it's good to simply just give unto God what belongs to God. Now, what do you do with the next? Um, I use some for my family and the rest basically for shopping. Some for your family, the rest basically for shopping. You see the way you mentioned that? Basically for shopping. Yes. That's the woman in you. Welcome to the finals. A round of applause for Sylvia. Ambassador Henry. How are you? 
Very fine. Today you are smiling. Smiling. I love your smile. Thank you. So how are you today? Uh, I'm fine. You're fine. Okay. Then I'm off your school. The ambassador's college at all. Ota. You also came from, from Ota today? Yes, sir. All right. Now, let us assume okay. that you win one million at the end of the competition. What will you do with the money? Uh, I think I'll go with Femi's answer. I would take the one million back to God and ask him what I should do with it. Okay. You are yes. riding on your Junior's um, yes. position. Okay. You want to take the money back to God yes. and then ask God what to do with it. How yes. would you ask God? In prayers. In prayers. Yes. Okay. Let's add those. This is the finance of as the audience sponsored competition. You're welcome to the final end. Thank you. Very Round much. of applause for you. And the wise man himself. Welcome to the finals. Wisdom. How are you today? You are fine. How fine are you? Say what? On the scale of one to seven. Okay. And you plan to win, don't you? Yes. Yes. Maybe you are not confident that you will win. Let's look at what how it pan out. How it pan out. Oh, that's a good one. Okay. I hope you are not talking to the camera people because they are the ones that pan cameras. No. But let's see how it pans out. Welcome to the finance wisdom. Thank you, sir. What's the name of your school? Igomode Grammar School. Igomode Grammar School. It's a public school too. Welcome to the finance. <laughs> yes. Distinguished audience. This is the final senior category. And you can see the six people. I can tell you that it was tough getting to this place for all of them. And of course, it was tough for all of us, the people who said the questions, and of course, the quiz master who was actually doing the trouble on the floor. Very tough. And I dare say, very, very tough. I am sure it's going to be tough too. But at the end of the day, three persons will be picked at least you'll have what first, second, third from among these tough six contestants. I welcome you, and I want you to give yourself a round of applause for being part of this show. Thank you very much for coming around. Yes. Samuel, are you ready? Yes, sir. John, are yes, you sir. ready? Precious, how ready are you? Sylvia, are you ready? Yes, sir. Are you bothered that, of course, you are in the midst of five men? Five tough and strong men. Are you bothered? A bit. A bit? Why should you be? Anyway, don't be bothered. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. What we need is what is in your brain, not the gender. All right? Henry, are you ready? All right. And the wisdom. How ready are you? Please log on to your site. Question one. If three-fifths of a number is four, more than half of the number, find the number. A, 50, B, 30, C, 20, and D, 40. Question two. What is the sum of the interior angles of a decagon? A, 720 degrees, B, 1,440 degrees, C, 1,080 degrees, and D, 1,800 degrees. Question three. If a card is chosen from a standard deck of cards, what is the probability of getting a five or a seven? A, one over 26, B, 1 over 13, C, 2 over 13, and D, 1 over, 1 over 169.
Question four. The first four terms of a sequence are five, seven, 10, 14. Find the eighth term, A49, B56, C32, and D40. Question five. If the occurrence of one event means that another cannot happen, then the events are A, mutually exclusive, B, empirical, C, independent, and D, biased. At the end of the first five questions, Henry, you scored 50. Samuel scored 50. Precious scored 30. Wisdom scored 30. Sylvia scored 20. John scored 10. Question 6. Cube root of an odd number is always an A, odd number, B, none of this, B, prime number, and D, even number. Question 7. Find the number of ways of arranging the letters of the word reached so that no vowel occupies odd place. A, 96, B, 48, C, 36, and D, 144. Question 8. A certain sum of money at simple interest amount to 1,260 naira in two years and to 1,350 naira in five years. The rate percent per annum is A, 50%, B, 45%, C, 35%, and D, 25%. Question 9. The first term of an algorithmic progression is 4, and the nth term is 110. If the common difference of the AP is 2, what is N? A52, B54, C51, and D53. Question 10. If the distance between the points 2, 2, 2, minus 2, and minus 1, x is 5, find the value of x. A, 2, B, 1, C, minus 2, D, minus 1. And that's the end of the first round. End of the first round, Henry, you scored 80. Samuel, you scored 80. Precious, you scored 50. John, you scored 50. And uh, wisdom, you scored 50. Sylvia, you scored 30. I'm afraid, Sylvia, you have done your best, but this may be the end of your journey. Thank you very much for coming on to the program. It's been a tough one. Welcome to the second round. This is the second round of the finals. And of course,
this second round, questions will come from physics, chemistry, and biology. We'll continue with the second round now. My name is Boke Rao. I remain your quiz master. Question one. Which of the following does not increase rates by affecting the number of nature of collision? A, increasing the temperature, B, increasing the surface area, C, increasing the pressure, and D, adding the mass. Question two. Two or when oxidized gives A an alkanal, B an alkanoic acid, C an alkanol, and D an alkanol. Question three. The number of proton, neutron, and electron in a sulfide ion are respectively A, 16, 17, and 18, B, 17, 16, and 18, C, 18, 16, and 17, D, 18, 17, and 16. Question four. The major part of an atom is A, space, B, electric field, D, C, nucleus, and D, orbital. Question five. In Fleming's left-hand rule, the thumb shows the direction of A, motion, B, field, C, current, D, charge. At the end of the first five questions, Wisdom scored 40. John scored 40. Samuel scored 30. Precious, 30. Henry, 20. Let's continue. Question six. Capacitor is fully charged if potential difference is equal to A, resistance, B, current, C, power, and D, EMF. Question seven. The work done in charging a capacitor is given by A, QV, B, 4 QV, C, 2 QV, and D, one, one over two into bracket QV. Question eight. A component that allows only unidirectional current to pass through it is A, resistor, B, transformer, C, diode, and D, inductor. Question 9. Which of the following characteristics differentiate a palisade cell from a liver cell? The possessions of, oil, of A, a cell wall and chloroplast, B, a vacuole and a nucleus, C, non cell membrane and chloroplast, and D, a cell wall and cytoplasm. And the final question, question 10. When Mendel cross round seed with wink with wrinkled seed of a peanut plant, what was the ratio of wrinkled seed to round seed in the P2 plant? A ratio A, 1 to 2, B 1 to 3, C 3 to 1, and D 2 to 1.
The tenth question is, is the result. Wisdom scored 90. Precious scored 70. John scored 70. Samuel scored 60. And of course, Henry scored 50. Please let's give them a round of applause. At the beginning, I did say that this was a tough set. And now you are seeing that this is a tough set. A round of applause for them again. <laughs> At the end of this round, there are two dice. The last two, John scored 120. Precious scored 120. But we may not be able to do anything with that tie because the two of them are out. Round of applause for them. Henry, you scored 130. And that puts Henry at third position. Samuel, from our class, you scored 140. And the standing public coach had wisdom. You have scored 140. Now, thank you very much, John and Precious, for coming. You have done your best. Your best is not good enough. Please, a round of applause for John and Precious as they walk out of the. Thank you very much. And of course, there's a tie between wisdom and Samuel. And um, one of them, we must have a first and we must have a second. Because of this, we will do another round for Samuel and Wisdom. But in the meantime, Henry, thank you very much for coming. You are number three. You, are, you have come third in this competition. Please. Thank you very much. Welcome to the competition. Yes, a round of applause for Samuel and Wisdom who have run into ties. And this is the extra session where there will be five questions and of course the one who has the highest, question, highest mark will be first and the one who has the least highest will be the second. Now, my name is Goki Rauf. I remain your quiz master. A round of applause for me. Question one. Which of the following will cause wilting implants? A, excess transpiration, B, adequate salt water, C, coldness, and D, humidity. Question two. Which of the statements is true about fingerprint patterns? A, correlate with individual blood group. B, prominent only at puberty. C. May be exactly the same for two individuals. D. Consistent for lifetime. Question three. Which of the following is a continuous variation in human population? A. Height. B. Arid factor. 
C, sex, and D, down soon. Question four. A man with heterozygous genotype for blood group B married a woman with heterozygous A. What percentage of their children will be universal donor? A, 25%, B, 50%, C, 10%, and D, 15%. Question 5. Energy of an electron in an atom is A, continuous, B, continuum, C, randomized, and D, quantized. Thank you very much. That's the end of the five rounds. And at the end of this round, there's also a tie. Wisdom, you scored 40. Samuel, you scored 40. Control, we go for another side. Question six. When a third particle is accelerated through a potential difference, V, its kinetic energy, A increases, B, varies depending on the resistance of wire, C, remains same, and D, decreases. Question 7. Quantum of electromagnetic energy is called A, waves, B, particles, C, photon, and D, electroenergy. Question 8. Which statement about the half-life of a radioactive source is correct? A, it is half the time for the radioactive source to become safe. B, it is half the time for an atom to delay. C, it is half the time it takes the activity of the source to increase to zero. And D, it is the time it takes the activity of the source to decrease by half. Question 9. Which of the following statements about ribosomes is not correct? Ribosomes A, release Enzymes for the digestion of bacteria, B, are attached to endoplasmic reticulum, C, are responsible for protein synthesis, and D, contain a large amount of ribonucleic acid, RNA. Okay, at the end of the nine questions that we gave, here, the results. At the end of the nine questions, Wisdom, you scored 80. And Samuel, you scored 70. It's been tough, so very tough. And I dare say this is the toughest of the competition so far. Hi want to congratulate Samuel for coming second in the second of the 2020-2021 annual quiz competition for students of secondary schools in Ogun State. Samuel, congratulations. And of course, with the wise man. The man from Igomo Day High School. Congratulations as you just won one million naira for coming first at the annual quiz competition for secondary school students in Logo State. Yes, that is the end of the Eddie Odin's Foundations. Quiz for secondary school students in Ogun State. It's been a tough time. It's been good. It's been nice. And of course, today we have the course to appreciate SD Holdings for this wonderful thing that they have done to Ogun State, for this wonderful thing that they have done for Ogun State people, and of course, for the attempt that they are making to make education get better in Ogun State. You have done well as the Holdings. You have done well, Samuel. 
you have done well, Henry, and you have done well of the competition. Next year, we shall meet again when there will be 2021-2022 edition of the Eddie Holdings Annual Peace Competition for Students of Secondary Schools in Ogun State. It's been a wonderful time. My name is Gokirao, and remain your quiz master. Thank you very much. Yes, it has been a very keenly contested competition and we thank God winners have emerged. A round of, a round of applause for the winners. The third position for our Baje Henry Ayomide, the Ambassador School author. On behalf of SD Holdings, we present to you this flag for coming top in the competition. Congratulations. And also a check of 500,000 Naira have been awarded to you for coming third in the competition. Congratulations. Goes to Ojo Samuel Oluwatobi, Up Scholars Universal College, Otter. This competition is awarded to Ojo Samuel Oluwatobi of Art Scholar Universal College, Ota. Congratulations. In addition, a check of 750,000 Naira also awarded to you for the school. In the senior category, the first prize goes to Ugota Wisdom of Igomode Grammar School. It's a pleasure on my part to give this award on behalf of SD Holding. I'm so happy. My coming here today is not a waste. So I'm happy about it. That at least one of our students from the public school emerged as the winner. And we are having who got our wisdom from Igomode Grammar School, Ota. I'm in fourth in this competition. Congratulations on the behalf of SD Holdings, wisdom has entered into the League of Millionaires. With a check of one million naira, coming first in the competition. Congratulations.
these two are going to be decorated as SG Ambassadors 2021. And with this title, it attracts a lot of benefit. You have become part of us. In fact, I cannot start mentioning what you, what you stand to gain. Is that all right? It is a privilege. You are welcome. Thank you.